Hey guys, so it's been a while since I've done a vlog video and uh, today I have kind of a fun one. So I was recently challenged to see if I could go a week without washing my hair. Now these people that challenged me know that I like to work out, they know I like to get sweaty, and they wanted to see if I could actually go the whole week showering keeping my hair dry underneath the shower cap, and then using their dry shampoo. I was challenged by the people at Living Proof. This is my favorite dry shampoo, and I do use it all the time, but I've never actually gone a full week, so I was curious to see if I could do it, if I could last. Because if I could, uh, with Tommy, I have like no time to shower, so if I can shave off any time getting ready after a workout, I'm gonna take it. A few things I wanna clear up in the beginning. I actually have not had my hair done since Tommy was born. Yep, I know, I need a cut and I need a color. You can see that. So this is all with hair that kinda needs to be cleaned up a bit. And second, I usually wash my hair after every sweaty workout. Um, I never thought that I could go uh, longer than a day or two without washing my hair. So I'm intrigued to see uh, how how this is gonna play out. Now, uh, I'm gonna show you guys my workouts and I'm gonna show you afterwards uh, what I did to use the uh, the Perfect Hair Day Dry Shampoo uh, to get my hair to look in uh, presentable and nice and maybe clean and even awesome. Who knows, let's see. Hey guys, so today is day two of the hair challenge. I got Tommy down here banging on some bowls. But this morning we got up and we went to spin class. I don't know about you guys, but it's been class. I get super sweaty. I had my hair up in a little bun um, to try to keep the ends from getting sweaty and to just kind of keep the sweat to the uh, the outer hairline area. Uh, so I'm gonna take a shower in a little bit and then once my hair is dry, I'm gonna use the dry shampoo uh, and I'm gonna check in later with you guys or tomorrow. Hey guys, so I just got out of the shower um, and I wore a uh, shower cap. Once my hair was dry, I sprayed the dry shampoo on the roots, let it sit there for about 30 seconds and then I just shook it out and just kind of got the dry shampoo out of my hair. So what it does is it goes in, it absorbs the, the grease, the oil, the dirt, whatever, and then as you shake it out, it leaves. Uh, I probably left it in a ponytail a little bit longer than I should have, so I'm gonna let it sit for a little bit to try to get out the kink from my, my, my bun. All right guys, so today is, what's today taught me? Today is Wednesday, that means it's day three. I worked out today at the gym. I did a hip workout with some push-ups, some burpees, and I think that my hair still looks pretty good. I haven't showered since Monday, and I've had two super sweaty workouts, and even got a little bit of volume. Two more days to go. So today is day four, it's Thursday. On Tuesday and Thursdays we spin, as I said earlier, they have babysitting so Tommy can come with me. Um, so I'm gonna take a shower real quick. I'm gonna blow dry the parts that are still wet, spray in the, uh, the dry shampoo, shake it out, and then I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on day four. Do you wanna be in the video? All right, so we took the shower, we used the living proof, and so this is day four. And I was in and out in probably about 10 minutes. Is that an accurate time? 10 minutes, all right. So Tommy is still in a good mood and he's eating the case that I keep my camera in. Um, so we have just one more day to go. We're gonna see if I can make it. All right, so one more day to go. So usually on Fridays I do like a strength workout, but I had a lot of work to do today. So today we are going running. We're down by the Charles River, and usually I run a little bit faster, but Tommy's with me today. It's actually his first day in the big boy seat. Ooh, bright sun. And I had a brownie after lunch, and I had a huge cramp. <laughs> so this run is not as intense, but it's a little warm out, so I am getting a little bit sweaty, so tonight will be the final night that I don't shower and I use the dry shampoo and hopefully I look glamorous and clean because we're going out to dinner tonight the whole family let's hope I don't look like a grease ball 
Let's go dry shampoo. Hey guys, so it is actually Saturday. Uh, yesterday when I went running, I got a huge cramp and so it really wasn't much of a run at all. It was more like a walk. I barely broke a sweat and by the time I got home, it was late and I didn't actually shower. I know that's terrible, but when you're a mom, some days you just don't shower. So this morning I decided to do a workout. I, I usually take one day off on the weekends and I went to uh, the club which is run by one of George Foreman's sons and it's kind of like a boxing hit circuit. There's like 12 different stations. You know, you do push-ups at one, you might do um, jump squats at another, you do rowing, you do boxing, um, box jumps. Uh, it's a really fun workout. I burned 600 calories. And I took a shower afterwards and I didn't wash my hair again. I used my dry shampoo once my hair was dry and then I shook it all out. And this is what my hair looks like on Saturday. And the last time I washed it, if you can believe it, is Monday. I was always that girl that washed my hair every single time uh, after a sweaty workout. And now that I've kind of finally discovered a product that allows me to forego shampooing after every single workout, it allows me to cut down that time that it takes to get ready after a workout probably by like at least 30 minutes. Um, now I can get ready in 10 or 15 minutes after I work out, which is essential when you have a baby. And so if you guys work out, you know, during lunch or you're just short on time and a lot of times, uh, you know, your hair might be holding you back from actually doing a sweaty workout, uh, definitely check out Living Proof Dry Shampoo. Links are down below in the more info. And I challenge you guys to see how long you can go without washing your hair. Uh, I probably, I'm not going to shower again today because I already showered, but uh, tomorrow on Sunday, I will wash my hair. I'm kind of looking forward to it at this point, um, just because I, I like I like getting my hair wet underneath the shower. It's almost like therapeutic, but, um, but I definitely uh, kind of proved to myself this week that I definitely don't need to use shampoo every single time. I don't have to get my hair wet and uh, still feel good about how I look after I get out of the shower. So try it out for yourself, links down below. I'm Sarah, I'll see you next time. Hey Tommy, Tommy, what do you think of your mama's hair? You think mama's hair looks good? Yeah, yeah. <laughs>